Hey everybody, Jason from the Mac and Tech community. We're going to do another podcast today, something I came across uh, from some community members in our chat room at Mac and Tech, and um, that is something called Cool Iris, also known as Pick Lens. If you Google Cool Iris, Google Pick Lens, it falls into the same category. Anyways, I'm going to show you what it's like. It's uh, Here, I'll show you on my screen. I have it all set up. Cool Iris can be used with um, pictures or videos on YouTube or Google or elsewhere and basically it helps you sort and organize by bringing up a screen where you can actually scroll across pictures um, kind of like the, similar to how the iPhone works I'll show you right here you install it, 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 it works on all three, three major web browsers Internet Explorer, Firefox and Safari once you have it installed and everything you can configure it and then if you're on like if, I, if I'm on YouTube and there'll be a little icon and I click it and cool iris pops up and um, this is cool iris now you may be wondering well why would I use that well it's actually easier to go through pictures and YouTube videos and stuff plus it's cooler like for instance I can uh, zoom in here if I like I type PCs in the search bar and then I just select one of the videos and a little icon to bring cool iris up and then I have this. I can scroll across videos that come up on my screen. I can zoom out. I can zoom in. So I can, you know, scan. This works for pictures. This works on Facebook. If you have some pictures of your friends or whatnot that submitted some photos, you can click the little icon and this will come up. You can zoom right in you know select the picture so I'm on YouTube right now I'm just gonna show you so um, basically instead of you know scrolling if you find a video you like because these are all thumbnails of the videos what you can do is you can just skim across them it's like the YouTube matrix it is so cool I, I you know it's really cool you, again you, you know using your scroll wheel zoom in so let's say I want to come across this video well, I select it here, and I can zoom all the way in, and it's playing some video about some phone. So I can, you know, zoom out, and just click away here, zoom back in, and then uh, let's say I just want to search some more. Here's an interesting video right here. So I select that, zoom in, and it will play the video. That is really cool. I think it's really neat because, you know, you can scroll across some stuff here, like, is that, a, I think that's a Mac commercial? Mac? Yes, it is. Anyways, yeah, it's, it's really customizable. You can customize how many rows you see, you know, just using your mouse down here to scroll, or you can flick it. You can take your mouse, this is my mouse, right here, and I can flick it. and it's 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 really neat for going through photos really handy so that's YouTube so if I wanted to search images like if I go to Google and I type stuff like PCs well you know you have your normal Google search here for pictures I just t click the little icon which would be in the little corner and cool iris will pop up and there there's all the pictures you can zoom in you can, you, you can use your scroll wheel to zoom across and it fades like how neat is that and I can go back to using uh, I guess the I don't know what you would call it but uh, you can scroll across and just just playing with it is really cool so I thought I'd uh, show you guys that Google cool iris C O O L I R I S or pick lens P I C L E N S it's basically the same thing you'll get the same results it's really neat um, it, it comes in handy because when you're searching for photos or whatnot right and it's just really cool it it's it's really live like and the way the smoothness of it, it, it it's really cool I like it so if you you know you like a photo 
click on it, there's PC for Dummies. Everybody knows that book. You can go to this button. Yeah, we'll go. There's a button you press. It's like a little square with a, an arrow, and that will bring you to that image, like just like being on Google. And then uh, you can go down here to return to Cool Iris, and it will come back up to where you were. Really neat. It works for Facebook. It works for any pictures. Instead of just clicking on the links and scrolling down or whatnot, you can just use Cool Iris to scroll through it. It's really neat. So that's that. I thought I'd show you that. If you have any questions, feel free to send us an email at questions at macintech.net. Stop by our website at macintech.net and our live stream site at live.macintech.net where we have people streaming all the time. And hopefully you enjoyed this video and you'll go and download Cool Iris right away because it is great and it's free. Well, happy holidays. We'll chat at you later.